All right, what is up guys? Welcome back to RimWorld. We're gonna get right into it. Just wanna say thanks real quick to all you guys that have been supporting these videos. Really hope you guys enjoy these videos. I know they're not the most popular thing on YouTube that I've ever made, but I hope you guys still enjoy them. I have a lot of fun making them. If you guys have any suggestions for the series, like things you'd like me to do in it, or if you'd even like me to continue you at all, please let me know in the comments. And without further ado, let's get right into it. I am streaming this. You guys can see this on Twitch live if you would like to can chat with me we have really good times with people you can drop down in the link down below and i will hopefully see you guys there let's get into it we got the whole crew they're laying down the the stones for the for the paths it looks great love it i think we need to cut all these trees down over here because i remember last time we had a bit of issues with the trees so let's make sure we don't have any trees around eventually i would like to remove all these stone walls and actually put in proper like actual walls but we'll get there someday yeah, I haven't streamed for about a week so far. I've been doing a bunch of other stuff, getting ready to go go to college, all that kind of good stuff. So I haven't really had a chance to stream since last time. Last time I did do RimWorld and it was fun, uh, but it's good to be back on here. Yeah, I think we're going to start working on lights as well because we have quite a bit of power. We're not really using our power for anything else, so this needs to be turned back off. I can see that there's some compacted machine right here, and I really want to get that. <laughs> I mean, we're actually pretty good for components right now, so I'll probably hold off on that. We have 37 components. Not bad, not bad. The Inevitable Soup, if you have any questions, do let me know, because I would love to show it off. I, I've played quite a bit of this game. I'm up to 200 hours. This is my 200th hour in this game. Woot woot. Still never beat it. <laughs> we really need it to turn winter, oh, sorry, spring already. I mean, it's already almost summer, and it's still snowy outside. It's getting up to 66 degrees inside, though, and almost not freezing outside. Uh-oh, are these guys... Oh, I thought they were fighting. <laughs> I was, uh... Oh, dang it. Their nose just got shattered. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Their nose just got shattered from the, from the roof collapsing on them. I don't know if that gets healed automatically or if they're just going to have a broken nose for the rest of their life. <laughs> they might. That's kind of funny, though. Yeah, uh, weak bones, you should kill her. I think we just barely recruited Nicole, actually. I think last time was when we recruited her because she used to be a prisoner, um, and she's no longer. But yeah, if she, you know, if she had weak bones, I definitely would. But I can understand. I mean, if I got, if I had a roof collapse on me, I probably would too. Ah, oh, wait. Oh, okay, no, that's an old, that's an old one. Okay. We just have an eclipse. No room for weak people. I'll let you know right now, Inevitable Soup, we have a lot of weak people in here. We have a lot of weak colonists. Like, a lot of these guys are plebs. But we love them anyways. When we started out, we only had three people, and they were just... We had one good person, Zebra, MVP, Bill, kind of an MVP, but he's also a bit of a tool, and then Hafael is just a total, ugh. He's only good for crafting, and you don't really do a lot of crafting in the beginning of the game, so he was kind of worthless for a while. <laughs> Interesting. So it's guarded by two enemies. If we succeed, their relation will improve, and they'll send us a reward of $2,000? Oh, worth $2,000. And it's Hyperweave, which is pretty nice, and a tech-proof sub... Sub Persona Core. Okay. Drop a roof on everyone. If they break a bone, they die. If they get injured but no broken bones, they live. We're gonna kill everyone then. <laughs> okay, so that's that's kind of far away from where we're at. We're we're right here. Let's pause it. So we're right here in Craps Quarry. I forgot it was named that. We need strong boys. You right. <laughs> that's that's kind of far. I mean it's through planes, so it's not that far, but there's no roads. So let's see. In two days we could get there, we'd need to kill them. We have a lot of guys, actually. I might do that. We'll get Bill, because he's our medic. We want to outnumber them. Three, three, to, three to two. And then, we don't want to take all the gun people, so we'll take Hiroshima. Because it's Hiroshima. <laughs> okay, so we, we've got some good peeps. That means we're going to be left with Beast. Uh, the only problem with that is that we're only going to have Nicole and Beast with guns. Which is fine. We'll We'll, we'll call that good. This is the first caravan I've done in this uh, run so far, so this is kind of exciting. Everyone's just being equipped with a longsword. I think we have three people with long swords right now. <laughs> They're going to go attack. Great, this is exciting. Look, there's the caravan. Bye. <laughs> See ya. If the caravan runs out of food, they can just eat Hiroshima. Sounds like a good plan. <laughs> they actually probably could. Yeah, they probably could 
just eat Hiroshima, jeez. Okay, let's make sure, oh look, now they're taking, yeah, now they're going fast. They have 2.7 days of food, they forge 17 berries per day. Ooh, a bulk goods trader. Look, there's a wolf and a bear, and Seymour, Seymour's just right next to the bear. Please don't eat Seymour. <laughs> Are they almost there? They're halfway there already, not bad. Will this go on YouTube? It will, it will. I'm gonna edit it pretty down. I usually edit about an hour into two videos or so. So I edit it pretty down, like down to 10 minutes per, per video. It's So we could sell Seymour for 70 bucks. <laughs> we really need this medicine. Do they have medicine? They have herbal medicine. You put a lot of effort into editing? Thank you, I, you know what, I really do. <laughs> I didn't used to, you can see some of my older videos from this year. You can go check out some of my older videos from this year. They're bad. <laughs> they had like zero editing. I just slapped them on there. We called it good. Not anymore. <laughs> Don't have any medicine. Big bummer. Normal clothes. What do we look like? Poor boys? Come on. Come on. We only wear the finest of clothes. I don't know how you put up with us. Oh, I love putting up with you guys. That's honestly the number one reason I like stream and... I record videos is because I love it when <laughs> I love when you know people say memes in the chat that's my favorite part I totally would buy a cow honestly because they're not that expensive except for the fact that they would die super fast because we don't have enough food however I say that but I can see the snow is starting to melt and that's awesome <laughs> but yeah I definitely edit a lot more of my videos than I used to because I literally used to just section them into different parts and then that was it go straight to YouTube uh, it was a lot. <laughs> I, I made a lot of videos with zero qu content or quality. Uh, Twitch is definitely a lot easier than that because there's obviously not really editing in this. Uh, I like both of them, honestly. I do like having all of my stuff included in a video. Like, you guys can see all of it right here. But I also know that a lot of people enjoy just getting, you know, the good stuff. And I totally understand that. I like watching really edited videos. I like watching just bulk videos. I like them both. And I, but I definitely like making highly edited videos as well as dropping it all right here. Ooh, a gift. They just left us a revolver and a wooden mace. These guys are awesome. Thank you. Yeah, it's only, it's just a shame though, because I wish, I do wish more people would stop by and just, you know, chat for a bit, because I honestly don't care about views. I just, Bill's caravan has run out of food. What are you talking about? We have 1.9 days of food. What? There's a subreddit called Never Broke a Bone. It's hilarious. That's why I'm telling you get milk and stuff. I've never broken a bone because I never leave my house, so it's great. <laughs> they have food still? What? I don't know. what That must have been a bug because they have food. That was that was weird. How strange. Okay, we have a sculpting table. They changed this. It looks very nice now. I like it. We eat meat tonight. <laughs> We're going to eat Hiroshima. He's a big boy too. Look at him. You can kind of see it in the stream, I guess. Kind of. Caravan arrived. Oh, okay. Jump to that. Okay, so we have two guys. They both have bows. <laughs> all right. Oh, they're already all drafted. I'm going to get Zebra to hide right here. And we'll get Bill and Hiroshima to get a little closer. Oh, he's coming closer. Bad move, friend. Bad move. Death in 11 hours. Nice. Oh, they're... Wow, that was awesome. Oh, and that person's fleeing. Nice. Let's be careful for traps, though. Nice! Look at that! Let's go see if there's anything in here. Yeah, that was easy. I mean, granted we attacked two guys with bows. <laughs> okay, what do we have? Pemmican? Yeah, we'll allow that. What are these? These are just marble tables? Interesting. And there's nothing in there. Just a alpaca wool bedroll. Really? Pick up pick up the alpaca wool. That's kind of valuable, valuable actually. What do we want to take with us? We could take a dead body with us. Let's hit accept. Intercraps court. Okay, they'll just go straight there. Great. All right. Well, that was a fun little thing. We made three grand off of that. <laughs> Not bad. Visitor. Ooh, a muffalo shaman. Looks like it's almost warm enough that we can uh, start planting again. What can we make? We can make a bolt action rifle. We can make. Ooh, we can make a pump shotgun for close quarters. I like that idea. But let's make. Let's make a pump shotgun. All right. They have herbal medicine. I'll take it. Gotta love it. And then we can just start selling stuff like this steel knife. <laughs> we have a bearskin jacket and a flak jacket. I didn't realize. That's funny. Uh, we can't sell all that. We could buy some beer. <laughs> okay. There we go. Hit accept. Look at all that cash. 
Uh-oh. This is what I was afraid of. Oh, man. This is bad. 